and this is how it looks looks premium and it's available all in this white color and the bottom part is metal yes. and here we have rubber grip which holds phone in place and also it has a built-in fan for cooling that's a really great feature to dissipate the heat which is produced during charging and here you can see the indicator so LED indicator is present so the maximum output which is claimed by the company is 30 watts and for the best output we need to use MI's own charger so I brought the 33 watts brick here which is from MI 33 watts so you'll get the best output when you combine these two so as I'm using currently Galaxy S1 Edge and Galaxy S21 Ultra and S21 Ultra supports up to 15 watts of wireless charging so I may not be getting the best experience out of this one so it can provide 30 watt output but my phone doesn't support that amount of uh, output so it's a bit disappointing for me but it's a really good experience when I use this one it does not heat up like other wireless charge which I have which is Rego's uh, wireless pad so it's it's just plastic build and it heats up a lot so compared to that one here the MI does a very decent job when compared to his dissipated or uh, fast charging this one gives me the edge yes of course it's pricey but not that expensive it's affordable and premium looking and it's really one a good one so let me show you how it works it's not me so here you can see the light was blinking now it's ready to charge the device so let's charge the device yeah started charging and for galaxy s7 edge it takes around uh, two and a half hours to completely charge the device and for my s21 it takes around three hours there is no heating issue as such yes there is a little bit amount of heat but not alarming though so compared to other uh, wireless charger which i am using this one does a really decent job so it's I can recommend this one to anyone it's a really good wireless charger thumbs up